but get comfortable. I'm comfortable. Are you comfy now? Yeah. Okay. I'm more comfortable now. Oh yeah. Yeah. That's good then. Now we have an inch foot. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Sure. <Yeah. laughs> I'll get the other two. But it. Right, really <laughs> excited actually today because um we all know I love a subscription box. She I'm knew. buzzing. No, I'm not going for a walk with it, <laughs> I'm filming a video. Just a moment. <laughs> Why don't you not take off your Fitbit? I can't take off my Fitbit, that's mental. Anyway, right, we all know I love a subscription box, we all know I love unboxing subscription boxes on here, and mm -hmm. we all know you love it when I do that as well. One of my favourite items that we've ever got in a Hugo box was um, a little notebook. I don't have it to show you because Megan's got it actually. So um, it was a little notebook and it was from a company called Nectar and Bumble and it was beautiful quality. It was all like um, almost like a waxy finish to it. It was gorgeous and it had yeah. really cute little bees on it. The pattern was beautiful. Um, so obviously I went to look into this company. I remember reading in the description that Hugo Box sent that, yeah. um, that they make a lot of their products. It's a lot of handmade organic products and it was set up around their love of bees. And I just thought, yeah. how cute. So there's lots of like handmade soaps, there's skincare, there's like stationery, there's gifts, there's homewares, and it's all centered around bees. And there's like little cute little, when you go and look on the website, there's cute little bee facts that just like, instead of just being a page of bee facts, they like dot them around the different pages. Yeah. So you'll be looking at like the notebook, for example. So you'll be looking at like a product on the website shop and there'll just be a random little fact about bees on that page. And she do like stationery. I do like stationery. And bumblebees. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so yeah, I just think it's super cute that they're just, they're just so adorable. So cute. Anyway, um, the reason I'm waffling about them is that I had a message off them recently to let me know that they have started their own subscription box service, which I just think is wonderful. Um, and Epic. they have, yeah. And they're very, very, very kindly sent us one. Yeah. Which is just super generous and kind of them. So look at this beautiful box. So cute. And let me just cover up my address. Uh, da -da -da! It's just so cute. I love it. Now, this is something I really admire about Nectar and Bumble. 10% of our profits are donated to bee charities to help save the bees in Britain, which I just think is brilliant. Yeah. Right, shall we open it and yeah. see what the crack is? I'm trying not to hit you the Oh, it says be happy. Let me just see. Ow, I hit myself <laughs> in the head. This is so cute. It says what's in it. It says what's in it. I'm not going to look. I'm not going to look. I'm going to look give at me, that give in a bit. Give it. Oh, right. So we have got the pale yellow tissue paper, which goes with their logo. Yeah. I like a theme. She do. I do. I like a theme. So I like that that little detail has been thought about. Yeah. And a cute little sticker that says be happy. <laughs> I've just seen something. I've just seen something. <laughs> And it's one of my favourite things in the world. Really? Yeah. Right, I'm going to put the box down because I'm going to knock everything off. <laughs> you can. This box is huge. You want me to hold it? Uh, yeah, actually. Let me hold Let's... it. Glamorous assistant. Assist I'm glam me. I'm, I'm glamorous. Glamorously. You can't just put it on your knee, that's fine. Right, so. That situation. Right, I have to put myself in the eye. Right, the thing I just, I just saw. Paul and I went to a food festival recently and they were there and I was like, ah, and I went running and I like get well excited when I see them in the shops. Right, so yeah. this is Mighty Fine, who make Mighty Fine chocolate. <gasps> Thank you. Um, and I think, I think it's Mighty Fine who have their own beehives and everything they make with honey comes from their beehives. I think it's them. Oh God, I love these. And I think these donate as well. Yeah, we donate to the good folk at Friends of the Honeybee to ensure a buzzing future. <laughs> Do you love a pun? Do I love a pun. I appreciate a good pun. Sh shall we try some? Yes. In the interest of research. Mm. 
<laughs> oh jeez. Fabulous. I have got more skulls. Yes, yes, you do. Right, so <laughs> these are chocolate coated honeycomb goodness. Yeah. Like the um like the well known honeycomb chocolate bar. Mm. 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 Like those, but I said, do you remember when we had these last? I said I think these are better. Yeah. Than the well known Cadbury's treat. Yeah, they are. So bold statement, I know. But I think these are better. Do you like the first one? No, you have the first one. I insist. Success! Yes! I'll wait until you get yours out. Oh, it's gonna melt. Ready? Yeah. Okay. Alright. Straight in. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> Crunch. Mm. Mm. Yeah. You, you went Italian. I went Italian then, that's how good this is. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, we got a packet of them. Well excited. Love mm. them. What's this situation? I don't know. Wrapped in bubble wrap. She do you like bubblerella. What? <gasps> Wait till you see this. It's so beautiful. Look at that. That is so nice. Mm. And I don't know if I have ever mentioned, I do like pink and rosy gold yes. situations. Have I ever? Don't think I've ever. Yeah, you've mentioned it once or twice. Right. I didn't think I had. A day. Um, so I think that will go beautifully around these ear parts. I presume it's like a little trinket dish or you could maybe put like a candle on there or something. We'll find out when we look at the list. But oh my god, that is so cute. Or even just a little decoration. Mm. That is so cute. And um, I'm sure this is a particular type of bee as well. That I'm really sorry. I don't know what it is. But this reminds me of the symbol that's used um when people talk about the um manchester the bombing that was last year in manchester i don't know um, maybe it, it looks exactly the same as like the tattoos yeah. people are getting and the bees that were around the city center and things so that's actually really nice that we got this today because it was the anniversary yesterday so that that particular moment in history is kind of on our minds all at the minute yeah. isn't it so that's really nice and I feel like every time I look at that, I'll think of that as well. And it'll be like a nice little reminder. Yeah. And I can like remember to send some extra positive thoughts to to those people that were involved in all that. But yeah. that is really cute. I really like that. I've just realised I don't have a clue how much this box... I'm going to have to like research how much this box is supposed to be. <laughs> be. <laughs> oh my God. This is so cute. And this is making me like want to cry and think of when Megan was a baby. Please don't cry. I can't promise. You've, you've spent all that time doing your makeup. I can't promise. But you've done all of that time for your oh, with your makeup. Look, it's got little bees. Oh, let me show the people. Look, it's a wax candle in the shape of a beautiful beehive. And look, it's got little bees and a little door for the little bees to go inside. Ah, uh, so this is by Bee Spoke of Devon. Oh my God, I'm loving all the bee puns. Do you just have the best time ever finding bee companies and seeing all the bee puns? Like, it's proper cute. I think so. So these are a company based in Devon, where my daddy lives. Um, Yeah, gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. I'm loving this theme. Yeah. You. Just like you. Just like you. 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 Trained her well, haven't I? Yeah. I am loving this theme. I love it. What next, Scooble Doop? That one? Okay, so this is. Is this a lip? <gasps> it's a lip tint. Oh, a lip balm. Oh my god, that smells gorgeous. <laughs> I don't think you're ready. I don't, I don't think you're ready. I don't think you're ready. I'm ready. Are oh, you ready? I'm ready. Oh, you weren't ready. I wasn't ready. Oh my god. I can't stop that is it. gorgeous. It smells beautiful. That's so good. Right. Um, right. Be lippy. I mean, we are, aren't we? Yeah. We do like a good old answer back. Um, it's from Beefair. 
Where have I heard of this company? Because I seem to remember saying something about Bee Fair. I don't know. Elixir. So many puns. That was the first Elixir of the video. Congrats. Um, right, so this is 100% organic lip balm with Melissa oil. Elixir. Um, and this is peaches and cream. What does it smell like though? It's don't know. It's making me it's reminding me of something. I don't know if it's like a drink or it maybe cream soda. It is, it's it's like a peachy cream soda kind of smell. I should say scent rather than smell. I do apologise. But you know, northern working class girl and all that. Mm -hmm. Do you want some on as a lip balm? Let's go in then. Because I've got my lippy on, so I can't really help out there. It's like a bit bumpy. Oh, it looks like it's melting. Does it like melt on? Yeah. <gasps> you, it, that's a really nice gloss. Ooh. Ooh. Shiny. That looks like a really. I'd be shiny. I'd rather be shiny. That looks like a really nice gloss. Does it feel nice on? Yeah. 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 Oh. Elixir. Yep, yeah, elix that one. Okay, next item. Obviously, every item in the box I will leave down in the description as well as details to go and subscribe if you would like to. Um, so yeah, let's keep going. How many actually? How many items have we had? One, two, three, four. Right, okay, let's go. Oh, you're so cute. You know this is gonna have a name by the end of this. So this is by AnnieDornandSmith.co.uk and it's a beautiful bee pin, a shiny little bee babe for your coat, collar or backpack or anywhere else you want to put it. Look at her. Don't put it on your face though. Not on your face, please. Go if you've got your ears. No. No, not no. on your face. <laughs> Do you see what they have to put up with? Oh, this is so cute. Do you want to wear it? Yeah. Excuse me. There's Charlotte's got her on! What yeah. shall we call her? Guess. Oh god, here we go. Lily? Yes. Yep. <laughs> Everything's <laughs> Lily in this house. Except for the bird. We'll not talk about the bird. I'm sorry. Yes, yeah, so... Oh, how cute is she? Oh, I really like that and it's really good quality as well. Mm. And I like that the, um, the stopper on the back, where they're usually metal with like a, a pinchy claspy thing, that's actually rubber. Yeah. So like it's it feels like it I feel like it would be a bit more comfortable against the skin if you're having it on the skin. Yeah, it is. Yeah? Yeah. Very nice. Okay. I can't believe there's anything else, to be honest. Then I'm gonna take this out of the wrapper actually because the sun is on its way around. It should be right outside our window. <laughs> so we don't want any of that bouncing off and dazzling you. So then we've got this gorgeous A4 print, which is kind of synonymous with the Nectar and Bumble branding, like on the website and things. Yeah. Um, we've got all the bees and the hoodie and the hoodie pots, hoodie pots, beehives. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's gorgeous. That would be, like you just said, that would be a good placemat as well. So that'd be a good, you could maybe laminate it and use it as a placemat or you yeah. can frame it and just have a nice little print in your house. Possibilities are endless. They really are. They are. Right, let's have a look at this here thing that I threw away. So I'm actually going to Google the subscription, monthly subscription price of a Nectar and Bumble box. Okay. Um, subscription box. Oh my God. Min breast. Right, okay, so this is the May box and this is the first ever Nectar and Bumble subscription box. So thank you so very much for sending this to us. Um, thank you. Oh, good girl. Um, so in this month's box, we have got the A4 Honey and Bumble print. We've got the Bee Spoke of Devon Beehive Candle. Mm -hmm. We've got the Annie Dornan Smith Bumblebee pin, as modelled by the beautiful Charlotte. With my yellow. With your themed yellow outfit mm. we had the mighty fine chocolate honeycomb dips thank you very much <laughs> the be fair peaches and cream lip balm the exclusive fox leaf hand painted bee ring dish and the value of this month's box was 34 pounds have a guess how much it would cost to buy a monthly subscription box if you bought everything 
in the subscription box, mm-hmm. it would cost you £34. Okay. Have a guess how much that box costs from the website. £20? £20. £20. <sighs> I, I, she I'm literally sorry. didn't know. Did you see it? Yeah. Oh, I thought you <laughs> guessed it. Um, twenty pounds per month. Obviously, it's a monthly subscription plus two pound ninety five postage. Can't really go wrong there, can you? No. I don't see an issue. You no, cannot go wrong. And as I said at the beginning, ten percent of all of that goes to bee conservation in the UK as well. And we need the bees. It yeah. might sound like a really boring issue, and why are bees important? But they really are like bees as much as i understand it and i don't know a lot about the subject but as far as i understand it the bees around the uk do so much to pollinate or so many plants around our country and if we don't have these plants we don't have a lot of food to eat yeah so it's not just that we don't have the nice flowers to look at and it's not just all about the pretty things it actually affects our food community. supply and our communities and yeah exactly so we're doing it sorry charlotte it's so okay. it is important and it is an important subject and i would hate for it to be in a subject that people only realize how important it is once it's gone yeah kind of dealio so do what you can please and any kind of bee conservation um there's lots and lots of things that are going on around the country you can do counting bees and lots of things you can do to get involved and i really think a great way you could get involved would be to subscribe to a nectar and bumble box i think yeah. we're going to for sure because i've really enjoyed that i love something that's got a theme to it like i love a theme yeah seasonal themes like my nails have themes they do don't they i have a mm-hmm. quite a strict <laughs> schedule for my nails throughout the year i have quite a strict decor schedule for the house especially for christmas your nails oh watch me go watch me go <laughs> um yeah so i love a theme so i love that everything's been really thought out like the pale yellow tissue paper the pale yellow um packing stuff um the even the colors of the products it all goes together and yeah. i really appreciate that um and i really really appreciate you thinking of my channel and my viewers to send your very first ever monthly box to and um yeah i really really like that box so thank you so much for sending that box to us we have really enjoyed that and i think now we're going to go and put our feet up put a face pack on and enjoy no these ear goodies yeah from said box um it was really fun to unbox it as well yeah it was wasn't it we like unboxing subscription boxes yeah. don't we <laughs> yeah really exciting yeah i mean i know i have been sent this box for free but i literally had no idea what was in it i had no idea what i was going to make of it I had no idea which direction Nectar and Bumble were going in. Any opinion I ever give on my channel is always 100% accurate. Yeah. I don't do lying, do I? I, don't, I can't no. do it. I can't do it. I'm far too honest. She literally can't lie to I can't. anyone. It gets me in trouble a lot, hmm. really, because I say some things that people don't quite like hearing a lot of the time, but it's yeah. just me. Um, <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, I will never, ever. It's just not in my nature to be told what to say. I don't get told what to do, do I? No. Really? I don't take that very well. And I can't not like I can't not be honest. So yeah. that's how it goes. So yeah, really, really happy with that. We will definitely be subscribing, I think, to that one. Yeah. Because we really enjoyed that, didn't we? I can tell yeah. you enjoyed it, definitely. I loved it. Yeah. <laughs> um you and grandma actually built a bee hotel, didn't you? Like Charlotte yeah. loves nature and wildlife, so any kind of chance Charlotte gets to try and help nature and help wildlife is like top of charlotte's list and like the best day ever so yeah i can tell you enjoyed that word and i know that you'll like that it's going to help nature yeah. as well so that's really really good and it's, it is a good way of getting your kids involved as well i suppose isn't it yeah you can open it as a family and you can discuss the reasons behind it and then go and learn about bee conservation as well so yeah early thought me too good job nectar and bubble good job um if you've liked that box head to the description box and go and order what's that oh jeez <laughs> what was that i don't know i think it was a cat <laughs> that really made me jump it's like what <sighs> anyway 
yes, if you would like more Nectar and Bumble subscription box, head down to the description and I will leave all the details there for you to do so. Please do subscribe if you haven't already. It would mean so, so much if you could come and join the family. And don't forget to give a like. Don't forget to give your thumbs up and go and press the notification bell too. To keep posted with this beautiful little face. Oh, yeah, God. Oh, yeah, God. Ooh. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye.